Hi Jess. Hello. It's currently Sunday, June 17th, and as you can see by the stuff in the back, we are currently on our way home from camping. Woo! Camping! Camping! <laughs> so it was a lot of fun and we're sorry you weren't there, so we're just gonna tell you all about it. We both went camping with Nicole and Jennifer, and it was just the four of us, but it was kind of a fun little group to have. Nicole found us this really great camping ground called the Betsy River Campsite, and it was just this super cute, adorable little, little campground. Everyone was so friendly, and we loved it. So we drove up Friday afternoon and set up our tent and unfortunately it started raining but fortunately we finished setting up uh, before we had finished before it rained so that was good um, and then we just kind of read our books in the tent for a little while and we played some card games and it stopped by the time we had dinner so that was good. We did encounter a slight problem when our tent started letting in water on the floor. Our tent may be about 20 years old. We borrowed it from my parents and uh, they don't use it anymore and we generally don't use it anymore because it's <laughs> just really not waterproof at all. Um, so we knew that was a risk. We were hoping it wouldn't rain on us. Unfortunately, it rained quite a bit. <laughs> so we made do. Yep. And I think we're gonna get our own new waterproof tent before we do any more camping this summer, just to be safe. But it was an adventure, and we learned a lot. <laughs> we did. We were able to have a fire on Friday night, and we had some great hot dogs and brats and, you know, good campfire food, and we were able to pack up and turn in for the night just before it started raining again. So, that worked out. And then it downpoured real good for quite a while. Mm -hmm. And thundered. And the neighbors showed up neighbors showed up to set up their tent and talk loudly to each other <laughs> with their four-year-old child and their bright car lights at like 10 30. Right as we right after we decided to turn in. Mm -hmm. It was all good. We got sleep. Mm -hmm. In the morning it wasn't raining anymore. There were some puddles on the floor. Um, fortunately Nicole brought on brought along this really cool diving towel that we used to um, mop up the water and wring it out and mop up some more water and wring it out and we're able to get most of the water out of our tent that way. We had to do that a couple of times throughout the trip but it worked like a charm. And Saturday was pretty similar. In the morning we had a really really good breakfast. They have a little cafe there um, in the store. All of their menu items are named after dogs so that was fun. And a fella named Sammy. Charlie. Charlie. And a fella named Charlie who hangs out there this summer. It's just so charming, you know? After breakfast, it started to rain again. Um, so we spent some more time in our tent reading and some more time playing cards. We spent a while under the, like, cafe awning, like, playing the card game Code Names, which was a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. So we did that for probably over an hour. It was nice. Nice way to get out of the rain. It was a good game. Um, but towards the end of the afternoon on Saturday, it cleared up and we rented some bikes and just rode all the way around Frankfurt and Alberta and it was so gorgeous. It's a really, really pretty area. We liked it a lot. So for dinner, fortunately it dried up enough that we could have our dinner on the fire again and we had taco pies and so boys and it was a good time. We learned from our fire making mistakes of the first day, so we made a much better fire the second night. Mm -hmm. Really this whole trip has been a lot of um, learning about what you need and, and sort of how to survive camping when you have no parents to think of everything for you. Fortunately today we didn't have any rain and in fact the sun it came out. It was very, very nice. It was really warm and really nice because everything was able to dry out before we packed it up. It actually got pretty hot. Yeah, yeah. We, we even got so hot that when we had all packed up we went and found a beach and well I didn't go in the water because it was really, really cold but Aaron did. 
it was icy but refreshing. <laughs> but we cooled off and we walked down the, up here and it was really fun. And then we had a picnic lunch with sort of leftover stuff and then we hugged goodbye and now we're heading home. So if you want to go camping anytime in the near future and you want a really cute, fun little campsite um, up north, then I highly recommend the Betsy River campsite. We loved it. We would love to come back again sometime soon. And we had an extremely positive experience just despite some really poor weather and a poor tent. So that mm -hmm. says a lot about the campus at the ground, I think. It really does. So we hope you're having a wonderful time in Vancouver and we will see you again on Monday. Ha <laughs> <laughs>